Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the channel. My name is Tony. This is Valheim, a brutal exploration and survival game for between 1 and 10 players, set in a procedurally generated purgatory inspired by Viking culture. Battle, build, and conquer your way to a saga worthy of Odin's patronage. It is sitting at overwhelmingly positive at 96% of good reviews on Steam. That never happens for a survival game. And I think, is it in early access as well? Yeah, early access survival game sitting at 96%. This never happens, so this better be goddamn good. I really hope it is. Please, 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 please. I have not touched it. As always, we're going in fresh, going in new, going in. Let's see what's about. Start game, goddammit. So that character, so he told you I've not played it yet. Oh, it's at that sort of graphics. Oh, I didn't realize that. Um, <laughs> I was like, where's the sound? Turned it all the way down. Right, new. Oh, so it's a blocky one. Oh, there's me. Um, Newcastle color. <laughs> it doesn't go out in the snow. Um, we're going to have no hair. We're going to have a beard, though. You can't be a Viking without a beard. Right, I kind of like that one. Uh, hair tone. Got no hair. Oh, color. Um. We'll go with that blondness. Yes! What should we call our guy? What's a good Viking name? Um, Bob. Bob the Viking. Done. Right, Bob, me and you are going on the adventure. Please go well. The name of the world is going to be the 15 minute game of world. Done. Aha. Um. I'm going to put... No, I don't want to start. I just want to start as me. That's right. Okay, that's good. I didn't want to um, risk that. So, yeah, this is like one of the most played games on Steam. I think it's about fourth at the moment. And I was like, I want something new to play. I've been looking for a survival game. I've been playing some Rust. But it's kind of not survival enough for me yeah it's got elements but obviously it's only got animals in or pvp I, you know i'm trying to find out how to put zombies in i'm getting there working it out slowly uh so this could be something good i'm looking forward to checking it out i've been there uh, keep my eye on it for a few weeks now watched a couple of gameplay videos nothing about the beginning so i didn't want anything spoiled of how it sets up and works because a good sign of any survival game is its intro and how it sets the world up. So I didn't want to spoil any of that. Am I going to have to work? No. <laughs> if I'm going to sit down, I'm going to have to read. Long ago, the old father Odin united the worlds. He threw down his foes and cast them into the 10th world. Then split the bat, the, the, the something that held their prison to the world tree and left it adrift unanchored a place of exile for centuries this world slumbered uneasily but it did not die as glacial ages passed and he read i can't read it no when odin heard his enemies were grown once again in strength he looked to a mid god and sent his valkyries to soar to the battlefields i didn't read the words in valham there we go that's my best accent of oh i'm a birdie Yay. bob and my bird is called oh they work now because I would call him Bob. We're going to call him Nigel. Nigel the... What kind of bird is he? Eagle? I don't know. He's got weird feet. Oh, do I just drop? Or does this thing drop me? I don't know. Sorry, I just left the mic there. <laughs> I guess it drops me, yeah. I, I, <laughs> I want to press the button, but I'm scared in case it just drops me somewhere totally random. So it's got this voxel-based graphics kind of by the looks of it. Ooh. You dropped me a temple, yay! See, I told you. Ooh. Ow! You were wet. I am wet. <laughs> I like the graph. I like the graphics. Hugen, I am Hugen, sent here to guide you in your travels. The megalith surrounding you are the sac sacrificial stones. They represent the forsaken, which you must slay in order to send to Valhalla. Valhalla. Yay! These magical. We're going to register that. Um, no, no one else is going to be in here, I don't think. Right, these magical stones are uh, scattered throughout the lands by Odin, a signpost pointing you towards the ritual grounds of the Forsaken. If inspected closer, you reveal the summoning place of Eek for your first prey. He's a mighty beast, so you need to properly arm yourself before you even attempt to defeat him. 
So he's just to the south of me. So we're not going south. Okay. Fair weather. Yeah, it is fair weather. I'm drying out now. Can I just keep talking to you? These magic... Okay. Uh, where do you want me to go, though? Or do? Or... Well, we're going to go this... This way. And explore a little bit. Ooh. Yay! Ooh, it's got proper skills. Can I have punch rocks? <laughs> Ooh, there's a... There's a deer. Go, a deer. I'm still wet. I've run out of stamina. Um, oh. Can I punch a tree? Yay! Punch a tree! I don't know if I'm getting anything from that, but I'm going to continue punching it. Look at me. I'm flying up the... Up the ranks. I guess you can't collect them. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Where's the stone? There you are. Yay! New item torch. Tunic. I'm still wet. I'll be wet for a very long time. Oh. Yeah! Survival games! Oh, we can have wood. Sto How do I um, craft? Well, I want a stone axe. Oh, so I need five wood and four stone. Okay. <gasps> There's a thing. What? Are you the bird? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I was like, why is it glowing? Most items must be crafted, however, due to your recent departure from Milk God, you have to recall the true shape of objects. Just pick things up and they'll come back to you, I'm sure. Yeah, we need wooden stone. Uh, thank you, little birdie. It's like a little glowing, scare scaredy thing in the distance. Uh, five and four. We currently have two and one. Ooh, he has more stone. Yeah. Ooh, mushrooms. Can we eat them? Yeah, we can. Sweet. Ooh, more stones. And more logs. The bird's back again. What do you want, birdie? You find a snack, consume it to improve your health and stamina. Um, Two, maybe, in the hot bar? Yeah. Just eat right. Oh, we've got torchy thing. Good. Oh, there's some more wood. Yeah, I like the graphics. I saw a few people whinging about the graphics, but I think they're quite good. Can I craft a stone axe yet? Yay! Three. Now we can hit this tree. Yeah. 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 I like the way you leveled up other skills while doing it as well. He's got one hell of a swing on him, hasn't he? He's not taking me... Uh... Did I hit the wrong tree there? <laughs> This tree is strong. By the power of Odin, I command you to fall. Yay. Oh, there's things everywhere. Ah, ah. <laughs> Got run over by a log. Give me all your stone. What happens? What's... About oh, two blocks, okay. I don't know if I'm getting from this. I'm getting... Oh, whoa. Don't know if there's like a backpack kind of... Like, limit. Keep hitting this. Pick up all the woods. Yay. Ooh, stump. Oh, we're going to keep hitting the stump, though. Skill improved. So it's actually put the stats up every time. I like that. Not many games do that these days. Ow. <laughs> Yeah, not enough games do that, you know, where you like, say you um, hit things, you should get more, like, stamina, more everything. I like when games do that. Tarkov does it slightly, but very slowly. And it can be a little... Yes. Right. Um, next, I want a hammer, which I can craft. So that lets me build things, and a club lets me hit things. Let's do both. I think getting the hammer could be... Yes! Oh, we could build a campfire. But where is that? I have a feeling you have to build something to then... Uh, build menu? Oh, yeah, okay. So, camp... Ooh. Bird's back! Hey, bird. What's up? Alright, I, I don't want to build that. 
With his tool, your raids might you holes and tower and fortification. Start by building the workbench. Okay, I can do that. But I want somewhere nice to build. Um, now I need some more. Ugh, I want some more stone. Some more. There seem to be many like open plains at the moment. I'm kind of heading back towards where we started. Don't know if that's a good idea or bad idea. But it was quite nice land up there. Like I don't want to be somewhere where I'm going to be stuck. Oh, loads of stones. Wow. That was good. Go and see. Oh, wow. All the stones. We're going to scout a little bit more before we... Uh, I haven't seen much food, though, to be fair. Like, I thought mushrooms would be a bit more common, but I'm not... You run out of stamina very quick. You think being beside the sea might do something? Let's go along. I wouldn't mind finding a little stream. A nice little stream house. Because maybe there's fish? Be all the wood. Uh, yeah, there seems to be a stream up here. So let's continue that way. Let's collect rocks and stuff. And if I can have a nice little house by the sea, I'm going to be happy with that. But if you can eat dandelions, I doubt it. I'm like in the blurriness there. Um, this isn't as flat as I f Whoa, what the hell is that? Hang on a minute. What are you? Oh, ow. Ow. Um, that is making like no difference. Nah, let's run away. Let's run away. Oh, this thing's going to get me, isn't it? Ha-ha! I fooled you. Right, so building there is not going to be the place I want to build. Because that did, like, no damage to them. Uh, I feel like I need a workbench to be able to do this. Can I hit you more? Oh, you I can hit. That's better. Oh, I like it. Ooh. I feel we dealt with that well. Liking it. I'm liking it. I see some open ground over there. That is where I... There's stones everywhere. Oh, look at this. This is where we're building. I mean, I don't know if I'm supposed to be this far away from anything, but... This looks lovely. Ah, we've hit a problem. Now the question remains, can we swim? We can? Okay, that's not as bad. I like the... Oh, there's little goblin things in the water again. This looks like where, where home's going to be. This looks lovely. Oh, dear. What is that, though? Um, uh, Do we explore? Yes, we do. There's a pig there. What do you think this is? This is kind of where I want to set me home up, though. Oh, this is lovely. This is exactly where I want to be. Gonna get me club out. Just oh, this is perfect, man. You've got the perfect house. Is it a house? Can we overtake this house? Who's a? It was just like a place, but can we knock this down, I wonder? 
Oh, we can. What a one of rune stone, yeah. Okay, wild boar. I like it. I think this is where I'm going to build my little settlement to start with. I think it's a lovely little area. The one this magic thing is in the sky, but yeah, this is it. This is it where it's going to be. Right, um, hammer. I need a building. Furniture. Crafting. Workbench. I need a workbench. What do, how do we rotate? We do that. Uh, I think this nice little view in the background could be good. Uh, yes. I have a little bird's back. Hey, I like this little bird. He's cool. I bring Titans. Good. I bring. Else, I don't know what. Um. We have. Oh my god, how much have we found there? Crafting station needs a roof. Okay. Yeah. Well, we have a lot of materials. Oh, wow. Okay, so we need floors first, I guess. So let's. Blocked by what? Hmm. Okay, that is a little bit weird. You can't see any. You can't see where it's going. You need like a foundation first. I think that's about it. I think that should be. Ha. Huh. A little three by three. Kind of hovering, but it's fine. Uh, we'll go four by four just to. Oh. Christ, how do you. Ah, that's easy. Nice little three by three. You could you could do get some food. Um, there was some boar there. We could try. Killing them things. Oh, we need a roof up here. Um, let's go and kill some boar. Where are they? There they are. Hey, boar. Oh, blow my neck. That was one hell of a hit. Come here, boar. Come here, boar. Right, so we have some meat now, so I think it's time to build a campfire and cook it. Boom, yeah. Right, and... Oh. Mm. Can't put raw meat on the fire. But that's where you would put raw meat, isn't it? Huh. That's where I would put raw meat. Very strange. Right, uh, five. Let's, um, <laughs> stone pile, wood stack, campfire, crafting, chopping block, cooking station. That's what I need. Surely, like, <laughs> campfire would cook. 
Um, what was I gonna build? Hammer. One of them. Oh, okay. There we go. Got some nice meat cooking there. Uh, let's get some more wood. Hit the log. I, yeah, this game, I can see where this game's coming from. All the wood and all the stone. Right. Let's um, build a door. Good, good, good. And then we need some walls. Um, let's put this away. We get that meat from there. Is that meat? Oh, no. So where's the meat garden that I was cooking? Huh. Okay. Getting dark now, so let's cut down some trees. Um... Oh no, three. Three, yeah. Get some more wood. Let's try and get this little house finished in this episode. And then if I can get this house finished, I will be very happy. Oh, you don't run away from me. Oh no, a little goblin thing. Hello, little goblin. Get it. There was a pickup thing there, but gone. Right. Don't roll on me. We're about seven. Yeah, that's not bad. Oh, not another goblin. No. I will kill you. And then you drop your stuff and I don't know where it's gone. Right. What have we got wood wise? We've got 13 out of 50. Deforest a little bit more. So I always seem to do in these games. You just seem to deforest. Fog there. Guess I need a bed. I didn't see a bed anywhere, but I guess you can build. Yay, good, 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 good. My thing is almost gone, though. Yeah, at night, I think maybe more animals spawn. Is there, like, foundations? I didn't notice any. Yay, look at us! This little house. I do feel cold, so I'm gonna go stand beside the fire. Ah. <laughs> now I'm not cold, no. Um are you sure game? So 
So don't get too close, I think was the moral there. Right, um, can we build some sort of bed? Yes, we need eight wood for that. Um, I don't think I can just nip and get some more wood. What about a roof? What do you take? This is going to be a cool house. Chopping block. Yeah, we'll probably need one there at one point, I think. One for the moment. I still understand where that meat went that was on there. I feel it's like in the ground somewhere, but I can't see it. I have to mold alone or something. But anyway, I think I will leave that there. That is night one done. So I just don't feel like there's going to be much happening at night. So I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye.